The question of how can you get 1600 degrees centigrade in a pneumatic craft thermo pneumatic processing plant be achieved? Well, the answer is quite simple, really, and it's this block which is in front of me, the fuel wood heater. The fuel wood heater is a mechanism block and on its own doesn't do a great deal. Feed it coal and it creates temperature. This unit is Kelvin. You can click this box and change it to centigrade. Don't know what that one is. Fahrenheit. I don't know what STP is. Back to Kelvin again. Makes more sense to have it on the centigrade. When fueled, this block will reach in excess of 6400 degrees centigrade. I'm not quite sure what it goes up to. It kept going up uh, when it got to 6400 and it didn't stop. Now, where does the heat come out? Well, the simple answer is it comes out of every side. Now you can see here these are in excess of 12, 1300 degrees centigrade. And yes, if you stand on them, um, you, you will take a nasty hit. The temperature also comes out from the top of the block. Now, when you place one on top of the block, it seems to dissipate the entire amount of temperature which is in, in the fuel wood heater. So I'm not quite sure whether that's some sort of release or not. If you let the fuel wood heater heat up and heat up and heat up, and then place a block next to it, the heat is then transferred, but you'll see it starts dropping. And this starts dropping. That's because the heat comes into this block. And unless you block the sides and the top off, it will get dissipated out of the block. The easiest way to stop the heat from coming out of this block is to use this thermal lagging from pneumatic craft and block off the sides and the top. Now, when you're using the thermal lagging, you can still access the block, which is underneath it. And as you can see there, temperature is now going back up and it's now rising back up in the fuel wood heater. This alone will get you to your required temperature. And there we have in excess of 1800 degrees centigrade. This will max out just slightly before 2000 degrees centigrade. The major thing which is crafted in this is the machine frame part. Not that one. Not that one. This one. So when you've got the rough machine frame top and then you coat it in the thermal pneumatic processing plant, you need a temperature of 1600 degrees. There are other recipes, the power cores from RF Tools Power, they require a machine base in the thermo pneumatic processing plant, and this requires a temperature of 1700 degrees. So there are other things besides the uh, machine frame recipe, but that's a very easy way of getting the temperature required into this machine. So I hope that helps. And it's the most common question that's been asked on Discord at the moment. So, yeah, I hope that helps. That's the fuel wood heater from Mechanism.